Good evening, students. How are you all? Today is Wednesday, and we are here back with another SST lesson of the day. Uh, we are continuing with the first lesson of our SST book, Earth, the Blue Planet, and today we would start with the second half of the seven continents. Okay, so without delay. Uh, let's do it and one more good news to you all today. I'm going to take you on a world tour I'm not world tour. I will take you on a tour during this lockdown time to Asia Africa North America and South America and I will show you the most prominent land features prominent art and, art, art and architecture of these few continents all right so have patience be with me let's go on a tour so students we will move on to the next continent after asia and africa that is north america north america is considered to be the third largest continent of the world. Third largest continent of the world. Okay. Now this continent is seemed to be surrounded by Arctic Ocean towards its north. You see, Arctic Ocean towards its north. Then we have got Atlantic Ocean towards its east. Towards its east, you see here on right hand side, East Atlantic Ocean. Then Pacific Ocean in the western part of little portion flanks of Pacific Ocean, a little portion of Pacific Ocean towards its west and southern side. Here west, here west and southern side. Now students, I will take you to the tour of North America to show you the Arctic Ocean. The Atlantic Ocean, the Atlantic Ocean, and the Pacific Ocean, how it surrounds the landmass. Okay, I will show you when I will take you to the tour. Now it has been seen that. North America, the continent of North America, continent of North America, this is North America and this green part you can see here, South America. This is connected to each other by a landmass over here. Connected to each other by a landmass over here. This landmass is the isthmus of Panama. Isthmus of Panama. Isthmus of Panama is actually a landmass between the Caribbean Sea and the Pacific Ocean. It is a landmass between the Pacific Ocean and the Caribbean Sea. The sea is the mass of Panama. How it looks. It lies between the Caribbean Sea, between Caribbean Sea and Pacific Ocean. And it joins North America with South America. Joins North America with South America. Okay? This is Isthmus of Panama. North America also is the proud owner of the landmass 
like Alpachian Mountains and the Rockies. So don't worry students, I'm not only going to show you the pictures of Rockies and Alpachian Mountain, I will also take you to a world tour to Alpachian and the Rocky Mountains. And also I will show you the beautiful waterfall of Niagara which is considered with the world the best feature of North America so this Niagara fall is it, you know it's the uh, it's a it's a huge waterfall of the world all right and that lies in North America and some portion of this has gone to Canada also mainly it lies in North America in the Niagara city okay Niagara City, Niagara Fall, and where is Niagara City? Niagara City is in New York. So mainly, this Niagara Falls lies in North America, and certain uh, a portion of Niagara Fall has definitely gone to the country of Canada, which is not part of America. Okay, USA. That is, that is uh, United States of America. All right. So now. Let's go and visit the beautiful continent of North America by ourselves and take a tour to Isthmus of Panama, the Alpachian Mountain, the Rockies and relish the beauty of Niagara Fall and also see how Arctic Ocean Pacific Ocean, Atlantic Ocean surrounds this landmass of North America. So students, we are here. Here, Bahampur. Could you see Bahampur? So here we are, Bahampur. From here, we would travel to North America. Okay, let's start traveling to North America. So first we will go out of our country that is India that lies in the vast continent of Asia. From here Let's move to North America. Here we are. North America and South America. Let me take a little broader view of it. North America towards the upper portion of the globe is North America. Towards the bottom portion of the globe is South America. Now students, as I said, I will take you to the tour of Isthmus of Panama. What is Isthmus of Panama? Isthmus of Panama connects North America with South America. So see this landmass green that connects North America with South America. Could you see this? Panama, Panama, Panama City. This is the landmass that connects North America with South America. This is Isthmus of Panama. Isthmus of Panama. Did you see this landmass? And see on the right hand side how this landmass looks. Is the mass of Panama? They have given given a little description also about is the mass of Panama. Is the mass of Panama also historically known as is the mass of Darien? Is the narrow strip of land that lies between the Caribbean Sea and the Pacific Ocean, linking North and south america see it is the see the blue portions on both the side of the green landmass is the water body okay 
it is the narrow strip of land that runs between caribbean sea and the pacific ocean you can see caribbean sea over here uh, and this above this big blue mass is the south pacific ocean so this is the land mass between caribbean sea and pacific ocean okay see how it feels if we really go by a plane and land in isthmus of panama it's easy it's coming soon see the land mass of isthmus of panama so it is made up of volcanic rocks isthmus of panama is made up of rocks volcanic rocks okay so next we move on to the large mountain range of appalachian large mountain range of appalachians see how we are taken to the mountain range of appalachians see we are in the mountains of appalachians of north america just imagine see how we are visiting north america we are no more in india we are in appalachians in north america the mountain ranges of appalachians see how it looks the mountain range the mountain range see i'm zooming it so this is how it is okay now let's move on to the mountain range wow we are being taken slowly to rocky mountains slowly we are going moving towards rocky mountains enjoy the rides to this yes we are here rockies of north america wow what a stretch of mountain rockies how beautiful it is see the rockies see the rockies how it looks it's made up of rocks rock covered mountains rockies there are so many different peaks in rocky mountains okay so this is how it will look if you go by a, a by a, a by an aeroplane and you slowly land to rocky mountains you see how it feels how it feels it feels amazing okay so the most beautiful thing of america see niagara fall is a city on niagara river in new york state it is in new york state it's known for the fast niagara falls okay let's see. let's see ooh we are in niagara falls now see such a fast water body Ooh, it's giving me goosebumps. It's giving me goosebumps. You see the beautiful water, vast waterfall, the vast waterfall. How amazing! This is the most beautiful feature of North America. You know the Niagara Fall. Okay, so you can stand over here and you can watch this, and you can take a ride also. Who will go on that boat? I will not. So that's what is our Niagara. See, if I see from a helicopter, 
oh my god just see where is it taking us just imagine if we happen to go to niagara fall like this see oh my god again it is taking us to the beautiful niagara falls wow just amazing isn't it it's amazing